Fabian enjoyed a long and prosperous career on the French national team. He earned his first cap on the 26th of May 1994 against Australia. He missed the Euro 96 campaign, which saw the team make it to the semi-finals. However, soon afterwards, he clinched the number one goalkeeper position and held onto it for a decade. His first major tournament as a starting goalkeeper was the 1998 World Cup campaign, played out in front of his home crowd. France were placed in Group C. They went through the group stage winning every game, with Fabian conceding just one goal. They faced tougher opposition in the round of 16 against Paraguay and eventually won 1-0 after extra time. The matches didn't get any easier. Fabian starred yet again as France beat Italy 4-3 on penalties. They then knocked out Croatia 2-1 with Fabian letting in his second goal for the tournament. Next up was the final against defending champions Brazil. Brazil went into the match as world champions. However, France sent the crowds into raptures by prevailing 3-0 and winning their first ever World Cup. Despite speculation to the contrary, Brazil's star striker Ronaldo made it into his team's lineup for the final. It wasn't long before Fabian was tested by the flamboyant star. A long ball from Dunga put Ronaldo through on goal. Fabian rushed out and the two collided. A goal was prevented, but both of them were left needing assistance from club medics. Ronaldo was given another good chance to score in the second half, after the ball fell kindly for him in the box. However, Fabian managed to get in front of the shot and save it. Emmanuel Petit laid the icing on the cake in the 90th minute with a third goal and the cup went to France for the first time.